Hi, this is Andy with Condi Systems, and today I'd like to show you how to set up your Ricoh SG3110DN as a network printer on your Windows-based computer. The first step in doing this is to actually assign an IP address to your printer. Now, if you've not done this already, stop at this point and check out my video for how to configure your Ricoh SG3110DN as a network printer. Once you have that assigned, the next step is to download the driver. The dr you can get the driver from the PartnerNet section of Condi's website. Once you have it downloaded, run the driver. You want to accept the license agreement and hit next. We want to add a new printer. Next. We want to connect to a printer port or LAN, but I'm going to tell it do not search and hit next. Here I'm going to pick the actual driver I'm going to install, which just happens to be the first one in the list here. It's Rico Aphysio SG3110DN RPCS-R. I'm going to put a check by that printer, and then I'm going to click on the plus to expand the properties of that printer. I want to click on the port tab, and I want to add a port. Here I'm going to add a standard TCPI port, click OK, and that's going to bring up the IP address wizard. I'm going to click next here and then I'm going to type in the IP address that I have programmed onto the printer. You may or may not get this screen. I'm getting it because the printer is actually turned off at this point. If you do get this, just simply click next and then finish. The next thing to look at, you're going to see a checkbox for default printer. You want to leave this checked only if you want to make this your default printer. So I'm going to uncheck this here and hit continue. And then the driver will start to copy over the driver files to your computer. Next we want to click do not set now. I'm going to click next here and then finish. All right, the next thing you're going to need is going to be the ICC profile. I have the ICC profile on a thumb drive but to obtain this ICC profile just simply send an email to support at condi.com requesting an ICC profile for your printer. Once you have it, just simply right click and select install profile. Now you're not going to see it really do anything, but that's okay. This is normal. The next thing you want to do is open your printers list. Now on Windows XP, this is going to be printers and faxes. Windows Vista is just printers. And on Windows 7, it's going to be devices and printers. 
once we have this open we want to find and select the 3110 right click on it and go to properties Windows 7 this is going to be printer properties not the properties at the bottom Once this opens, we want to come over to the Advanced tab and select Start Printing After Last Page is Spooled, and then come over to the Color Management tab. Now, Windows Vista and Windows 7, you'll see a button here that says Color Management. Simply click on this, and then on the pop-up window that comes up, select the printer in the menu at the top. Next, you'll have a checkbox below that that says Use My Settings, and then you'll have a pull-down where you can select between Automatic and Manual. On Windows XP, you just simply click on Manual. On the other two operating systems, set the pull down to Manual. And then click the Add button in the bottom left. And look through this list for your ICC profile. Now here it's showing up as RICO SG3110 RGB SJR version 1.0. Um, on some machines, this will show up as SG SG3110 RGB SJR version 1.0. You want to select that and hit Add and then click OK. On Windows Vista and Windows 7 you click close and then click OK. Once we have that configured we right click on the printer and go to printing preferences. Once here we want to change the select print quality pull down to user settings and then change the paper type to inkjet plain paper and then I'm click on, gonna click on the detailed settings tab and I'm going to select edit in the menu at the top and then in the bottom section I'm going to scroll all the way to the bottom and set printable area to maximum next I want to scroll over in the menu select print quality change the dithering to use air diffusion auto image I want to set color profile to off I'm going to set gray reproduction to CMY plus K and then I'm going to scroll down. I'm going to set resolution to 600 and then set vector raster to raster. Next I'm going to click register current settings and I'm going to type in Condi ICC and hit OK. Now we'll go back to the one click presets. Make sure you have Condi ICC selected under the preset list and click OK. Then close out your printer list and then configure whichever application you're going to be printing from to apply the color profile. If you have any questions with this or any other issues that we support at Condi Systems, simply give us a call at 1-800-826-6332, option 2, or send us an email to support at condi.com.